Okay, we're going to do a really, really quick tutorial uh, today. Uh, it's going to be exploring using the mod wheel over here with Unisono. So we start with a default init patch, which is an 8 foot sawtooth, which works what we're doing. We're not even going to play with filters or anything like that. We're going to write a mod, very simple modifier, and then we'll write it a different way to show you the two ways you can do this, because there are two ways of writing modifiers or creating modifiers as long as they, were, they um, have this multiplication. So the first way, we're going to take mod wheel on modifier 1 slot, get mod wheel, and we're going to multiply it by unisono. Well, as Unisono is not engaged right now, it's not going to do anything, so it won't do anything because there's no Unisono right now, as expected. Go to the uh, Oscillator Common page, select Unisono 3, detune it, say 12, write a mod slot. Right now I'm very close to 9, so I go modifier 1. And I'm going to have it control 01 pitch 42. <laughs> Because uh, Unisono is just an index, what you basically have, with Unisono set to 3, you have it multiplied by minus 1, 0, and plus 1. And one thing I forgot, let's add it in right now, panning. I'm going to set that to Unisono, reef it all the way down to minus 64 to do a stereo. So in this situation, uh, that index minus 1 is being multiplied by the left, so it's taking the pitch down an octave. It's leaving the center position, which is unisono 0, per se, at 0 and not doing anything with it. And it's taking the right index plus 1 and multiplying it up an octave. Okay, so we've done it that way. Let's get rid of that modifier. Remove it. So it can have no effect. We'll go to the mod slot and get rid of that as well. Now we'll do it a different way with the same effect. I'd like to zero everything out. And go to modulation slot 5. I'm going to say mod wheel controls. M1 amount, for now I'll leave it at zero. I go to modulation slot one, or say unisono, controls a one pitch. Now I'm pretty sure I set this 42. It may be 38, but let's find out very quickly. It's 38. Now that's affecting it across the stereo field and it's affecting it the exact same way. It's as though I have taken the two and multiplied them together because mod wheel plus 38 to M1 amount is being multiplied by the unisono and doing the same thing as a modifier. So that's two ways you can do a modifier as long as it's multiplication. It doesn't work for AND or 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 XOR or anything else like that. It's higher and higher octaves. Instead of the 52, it's going to be crazy. It's out of the audio range.
and bring it back to Unity. And uh, basically that's it. I just wanted to show you what you can do with a mod wheel and Unisono. Time to put it on YouTube.